In this video, we will solve 39th question from second set of mechanical engineering question paper that was conducted in GATE 2018. The question is, a force 100 Newton is applied to the center of the circular disc of mass 10 kg and radius 1 meter, resting on a floor as shown in the figure. If the disc roll without slipping on the floor, the linear acceleration in meter per second square of the center of the disc is corrected to two decimal places. You can also refer to the NPTEL video lecture number 22, Circular Motion, Engineering Mechanics, Mechanical Engineering, coordinated by IIT Madras. Before moving to the video solution, we need to know some basic formulas. The first one is, the summation of all the external force is nothing but the mass times the acceleration of the body. Similarly, the summation of all the external torque applied on the body is equal to the product of its moment of inertia and the angular acceleration. With these formulas, we can find the acceleration of the solid disk. Let us move to the video solution. Here we have given a circular disc which is resting on a floor and then a 100 Newton is applied at the center. So the first step is to understand what are the external forces that are applied on the body. The first one is obviously the 100 Newton which is, a one, which is an external force and the second one is a frictional force. Frictional force will be acting in this direction opposite to the force applied. So that is frictional force Fs. And the, uh, the data is given are the mass of the body is 10 kilogram and the radius is 1 meter. Applying the first formula that is sigma F equal to m into a. Sigma F is uh, will take to this side as positive therefore this side will be negative. So, 100 Newton is applied in the forward direction minus Fs because Fs is acting in the negative direction minus Fs. So, that is sigma F 100 minus Fs equal to m into a mass times acceleration. This is equation number 1. Okay. Then second, uh, the second one is, second formula we have... Uh, the second formula is the summation of external torque I into alpha, where I is the moment of inertia of the circular disk the, uh, through the axis passing through the center of gravity. So what are the external torque apply, uh, acting on the body? Since 100 Newton is applied at the center, there will not be any torque due to 100 Newton. The second force which is external is the Fs. And since Fs is acting at a radius r from the origin, from the center, there will be a torque. And that torque is Fs into r, where r is the radius. Fs into r is the external torque. So, Fs into r equal to I into alpha. This is alpha, okay, where r alpha is the angular acceleration. I is the moment of inertia of a circular disk passing through the center of gravity that is nothing but mr square by 2 mr square by 2 into alpha but what is alpha alpha is nothing but the angular acceleration and we know that a equal to r alpha for a pure rolling substituting alpha so alpha is nothing but a by r which gives m r a by 2 but in LHS we have r and RHS we have r so therefore fs is nothing but m a by 2 now we will substitute this is an equation number 2 and we will substitute equation number 2 in equation number 1 so after substituting after substituting 100 
minus f s is m a by 2 m a by 2 equal to m a taking minus to this side we have 100 is equal to m a plus m a by 2 that's nothing but 3 m a by 2 implies acceleration is nothing but taking to 2 by 3 m to this side we have 100 into 2 divided by 3 m therefore the acceleration substituting these values 100 into 2 divided by 3 into mass the mass is nothing but 10 kilogram 10 kilogram therefore the answer is 20 by 3 20 by 3 is nothing but 6.666 meter per second square therefore the answer to this question the linear acceleration of the center of the disk is a equal to 6.67 meter per second square coming back to the slides for this question a force of 100 newton is applied at the center of the circular disk of mass 10 kilogram and radius 1 meter resting on a floor as shown in the figure if the disk rolls without slipping on the floor the linear acceleration in meter per second square of the center of the disk is 6.667 meter per second square we can also refer to the NPTEL video lecture number 22 circular motion engineering mechanics mechanical engineering coordinated by IIT Madras thank you